What's good everyone? It's me, Terra Draw. Welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are having an amazing day. And we're back with another Julian the Phantoms reaction video. We have finally made it to the final episode, sadly. I'm not ready to end the season, I'm not gonna lie. So for the final episode, we have Stand Tall. I have heard the song, but now I'm gonna finally know the context behind the whole episode and everything. So let's see what we got today. So Julie and the Phantoms get their dream gig at the Orpheum. I'm guessing they're just gonna perform without saying anything. But when Caleb interferes, Julie searches for the courage to perform on her own. I'm not ready for this episode, I'm not gonna lie. But if you guys wanna check out the last episodes, those links will be down below. Full playlist will be made, and without further ado, let's get right into it. Panic at the disco, okay. Look, don't worry guys, Willie said to get us on that marquee. This is gonna work, right? It has to. Yes. <sighs> hey, you guys okay? Does it look like it? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, we haven't felt before. How'd it go? Well, when that opening band wakes up, they're gonna find their bus 200 miles outside of Vegas with no chance of getting back in time. <laughs> and that means there's probably a promoter upstairs right about now freaking out. Nah, this is Hollywood, man. I'm sure he's being very professional. What do you mean the bus drove itself into the middle of the desert? I thought that was bird from, oh my gosh. Themselves. I know how much you're risking. Thank you, Willie. I told you, I'd do anything for you. Oh. oh no! Sorry, the feels are kicking in, man. All right, you uh, you better get out of here before Caleb catches you with us. Screw Caleb, bro. Yeah. I'll see you around, hot dog. <laughs> You alright, man? Yeah. Yeah, I'm okay. Well, thanks to Willie. Panic at the Disco needs an opening band. Mm -hmm. And I guess someone up there needs to know we're available. <laughs> no, no, stop. 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 Stop saying the bus drove itself. <laughs> yeah, Willie was right. This guy's a total pro. All right, boys. Let the magic happen. Alex, no dancing. What? Okay, there we go. Oh, hey, that's what I'm go, go. saying. Go. Just come in, just come in. Cause we're standing on the edge gotcha. of... Let me CJ and tell him I need a band to open in three hours. Sure, but you might want to check this out. They pulled that up oh, mad good. quick. Somehow this video started playing on my laptop. It's got half a million hits in just two days. Who are they? They're a hologram man. They call themselves Julie and the Phantoms. Oh, your friends. <laughs> Where are they located? Our very own City of Angels. Book them! Yes! Sure, I just don't know how to... is better than mine. Definitely. Yeah. I have some terrible handwriting. Oh my gosh, what took you guys so long? Did Willie do it? Did you talk to the promoter? Did they watch the video? Did well, they like us and replay tonight? Can someone answer me? Why is no one saying anything? Bro, <laughs> that's a lot of questions. Luke, do you want to take this one? Take your seat. It's fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, you should be getting a call right now. I really thought it was gonna happen. Okay. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, nailed it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> Hello. Hi, this is Tasha from the Orpheum. 
<laughs> Yo, that's crazy. What happened? Let's go. Clock move faster. And I forgot the lyrics. I'm telling you, Tia, it was a win-win. The ghost is gone, and me and Dad got a killer French dip sandwich. But how do you know the ghost is really gone? I don't want to get emotional, but I felt something when I took that last bite. I guess tortured spirit was set free. Are you sure it wasn't one of your little tummy toots? I feel like I've seen this kid I somewhere. Tummy toot? I'm a ghost hunter now. I'm starting a channel, Carlos the Ghost Toaster. I like it. Did you, mijo, the ghost, did you check the closet upstairs? Hold on a second, Tia. Uh-oh. I knew it. Ghosts. Tia, you gotta go. Gotta go. This kid is oh, Sherlock Holmes, I swear. <sighs> Yo. Hey, baby. What is that? Sounds good. Please don't say that. Yeesh. No, I need to see this. Say, is that, is that Julie? Yeah, she's a band with those guys. Of course, she needed a gimmick. They're holograms. And somehow, because the world hates me, they're playing the Orpheum tonight. Oh. How's that even possible? I know, right? Boy, looks to look like John Wick. Give me to the orphan tonight. Plus one. Why do you hate me too? Only love, baby. Only love. I was waiting for something like this to happen. We start with staying tall. Perfect. Sounds good. Sounds good. Dude, wake up. I want to hear it sounds awesome. I know this isn't how we wanted things to turn out, but... We gotta be all in tonight. This is our second chance at playing the Orpheum. I, I get it, I get it. But it's hard. Do we even know what's on the other side when we cross over? Do we all still get to hang together? You guys are the only family I have. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know what's gonna happen either, but it's not like we have a choice. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure we do. And it rhymes with the Hollywood Ghost Club. Are you ready? What's wrong? Yeah, I just got rocked pretty hard by one of those jolt things. They're thinking of doing it? Pretty sure I ghost peed a little. But we're fine. Actually, guys, I'm a little nervous. That's my sister having an actual conversation with her ghost band. Let's listen in. Uh, can I talk to you for a second? Yeah. Try this on. Oh. Oh, never mind. What? Um, can you do me a favor? <laughs> Anything, Julie, you know that. When you cross over, if... Mom. If you happen to see my mom, can you tell her I love her? And thank her for bringing you to me. Yeah, I will. Band Circle? Yeah. Guys, Band Circle. This episode's gonna hit, man. I'm not ready. We don't know what brought us here, but what we do know is you're a star, Julie. And just because this is our last night together, it doesn't mean we'll be watching you from above. Or. Now let's go rock this show. Let's give them a night that they'll be talking about till the sun comes up, okay? <laughs> Legends on three. One, two, three. 
That's my dad. He's driving me there, so I'll see you guys soon. the blinds or you know what the blanket you know it could have been any number of things you did in that house it doesn't matter you guys we're not coming back here anyways oh my, oh my. Where is it that you think you're going what are you doing here such hostility i'm just here to congratulate you on your big night <laughs> not everyone gets to play the orpheum no no okay we know that it's your state that's hurting us mm. we already told you we have a band we don't want to join the little club and you can't make us either. <clears throat> Sir? Right. You're crossing over tonight. So exciting. Funny thing about the crossover. No one really knows what's waiting on the other side. The other side. But I know what's happening on this side. <sighs> <laughs> what the heck? Getting intense, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my gosh. Hey Julie, I've got your roadie. Come in. Holograms are good to go, boss. Julie's a real one. Best roadie ever. I'll be back in a few minutes to walk into the stage. Thanks, Rob. You see this backstage pass? I had sushi with Brendan Yuri. Good for you. I threw up in the car on the way over here. And you still look amazing. <laughs> I made friends with the tech crew. You're gonna love what we have planned. Flynn is such an underrated Guys, character. Right? I, I swear. Seen him. Such a goat. Wait. You don't think they changed their mind and took Caleb's offer, do you? No, no, that's the last thing that they wanted. You're gonna kill it. We should get some snacks. <laughs> well, don't you look nice? Sweet threats. How, how, how'd you know our sizes? That's your question? I know you boys aren't my biggest fans, and an eternity at my club might seem overwhelming, but I just put you in sweet threads, so humor me this one last pitch. Now, for starters, isn't it nice that you're all here together? And believe me, everything you want, including Willie, is here and on my stage. You don't vanish when the music stops. You soak in the applause for as long as you want. The connection that you will feel with that audience will be like no other. I promise. Do you hear that? They're waiting for you. <laughs> that one looked like it hurt. Now, let me remind you. You don't know if playing the Orpheum is your unfinished business. Do you really have time to make that mistake? I suggest you accept my offer because the clock is ticking. Ouch. You know where to find me. Such a snake, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm back! Hello, hello, hello. You know you wanna take a chance and be a little bit bad. Ain't nothing quite. Okay, I can't lie, this dude knows how to make me vibe, though. I can tell he's really good at Broadway. It's 
such a villain theme song, I swear. No. Is he controlling him? Yup. But you, for the sake of this, we stand Julian the Phantoms, not you, sir. I'm only vibing because, you know, this sounds good. He kills them vocals, though. Oh, my gosh. His range is crazy. Dang. Falsetto oh, was crazy. And then he could go so low, what the heck? Ooh, oh my god, those vocals are insane. Come on now. We get he's the villain, but those vocals. Dang, okay. All right, now time to go to the Orpheum. Hey, Julie, it's time. Just a second. Something's wrong. The boys were giving those jolts pretty bad as I was leaving. And they wouldn't stand me up again. They must have run out of time. No. I'm so sorry, Jules. They didn't cross over. They're gone. And I didn't even get to say goodbye. Hey, Julie, you're on. Wait. No, no. What are you doing, Jules? Uh, where's she going? Where do any of us really go? We've got a problem. Julie, no, 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 no. That's the street. I don't know if you can hear me, Mom, but... I can't help it. You know, Flynn says that you're supposed to be behind everything, but... I don't know. If I was supposed to help the guys... I did it. They're gone. I'm so sorry. They were my friends. My band. My family. Why can't you just come pick me up? And, and hold me in your arms and just tell me that everything's gonna be okay. I'm gonna get through it. That, that even though they're not here with me, they're still up there with you. I just wish you were here. Time to kill it, Julie. Let's do this. 
If it isn't my favorite person, Carrie and John Wick. Let Panic know they are going on now. Let's do this. Science. Wait, where are you going? She's going on stage. Hold on. Julie just walked onto the stage. That's my girl. Welcome to Live at the Orphan. Now give it up for Julie, Julie and the Phantoms. <laughs> So beautiful. I love this song so much. Hi, I'm Julie. Um, tonight, I'd like to dedicate this song to my mom, who's been there with me every time I've played, and thank her for not giving up on me. I'd also like to dedicate tonight's performance to three special friends who have changed my life completely, who have brought music back to me. It was their dream to play here, and this is for them. This song is for anyone who's lost their way. Step into your greatness. Don't give up. Stand tall. Thank you. I'm, not gonna, I'm getting emotional. I usually get emotional, but this right here, this is in such an emotional episode. here before soccer sorry nope don't do that Bobby think oh Bobby probably thinks he's off something right now. Ryan! My boy Ryan's here! Sorry! Oh my god, Luke's lagging. I'm a stand tall, I'm a stand tall Oh my gosh Bobby, what's going on Bobby? I'm a stand tall, I'm a stand tall Yo! Ooh, the harmonies. Let's go, Alex! The vocals, Reggie's vocals. Those 
I have harmonies in the back. Oh my gosh. Taking in that applause. Still don't know how she does those hologram things. <laughs> Yeah, Carrie, I love you now. And Bobby is, I don't know, he's probably going to take some type of therapy after this. I don't know. Don't end it like that. You and your phantoms were unbelievable tonight. And I'd like to thank them for bringing music back into your life. I already did, but I didn't thank you, Bobby. Hey, Julie, uh, can I talk to you for a second? Yeah, yeah, um, just give me a minute. Okay, I'll wait up. Don't ghost me. <laughs> just a minute. Okay. Love you. Love you, too. Oh, no, this is about to hit. happening why are you here I, I thought <laughs> I thought you crossed over why did you cross over I guess playing the Orpheum wasn't our unfinished business maybe it was with Point Bobby Caleb. we wanted you to think that we crossed over so we pretended to we just no. We had nowhere else to go. We thought she'd go straight to bed. Yeah, well, I knew she was going to come out here, but nobody ever listens to me. <laughs> you have to save yourself right now. Go join Caleb's club, please. It's better than not existing at all. Please just go. Go poof out. Do something, please. Do it for me, please. We're not going back there. No music is worth making, Julie, if we're not making it with you. No regrets. What? I love you guys. No. Oh, the crossing! That was that your unfinished business to hug Julie? How can I feel you? I feel stronger. Alex, Reggie, come. <laughs> what? The, the crossing. Oh. I, 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 I don't feel this weak anymore. <laughs> for that week. <laughs> what? what do you think that means? It was a good ride, Julie. I think Ben's back. Wait, um, no, wait, are they staying on Earth? You guys think we could try that hug thing one more time? Me 
Oh. <laughs> we played the RPO! <laughs> yeah, we did! Happy endings do exist! Wait a minute. Oh, Ryan is coming back for redemption. How sweet. The broken hearted teenager fighting for his girl. Do I know you? You will. Okay, this is some Stranger Things type. What was that? I have a fight too. Hi, Nick. Him getting possessed possessed by Caleb, I can tell that man had no game back in his day when he was young. You see how he walked up to Julie like that? Homie had no game. Look at that. Was that that was not smooth at all. Thanks. Second of all, I seen this in the movie. They need to like do that whole may the power of Christ compel you thing. This dude needs to have an exorcism. Oh my gosh. What just happened? I'm going out of my mind. I'm a stand tall. I'm a stand tall. Okay, had a vibe real quick. That was crazy. So, did they cross over? Did they not? And also, I just want to point out I really think the girl from the first episode is Julie's mom. It has to be. She had to be a part of the show. Like, she just had to have an impact on the show somehow. There's no way they just showed her for no reason. So I definitely think the girl from the first episode is Julie's mom. Second of all, like I said, do they cross over or not? If not, the band is back. We got to play that song. I forgot how it goes. But third, so Caleb, season two is definitely coming. And I don't know when, but I'm very excited. Um, so all I know is um, you guys watch Stranger Things. You know how that big Demogorgon like possesses Will. Like the big gray things like they all go in his throat too. The same thing just happened to Ryan. May his soul rest in peace. Oh my gosh, the dude is possessed now. He's going to have to have an exorcism of episode 8 of season 2. And <laughs> I'm sorry. That was just a lot to take in. What was that? So Caleb, he can make himself... Be seen by humans. Now Caleb is very salty and I just can't wait to see what season 2 is going to be about. Now what we're going to be watching next is we are going to be watching the behind the band and we're going to be reacting to their solo music. I can't wait to get into that. This is going to be crazy. Oh, shout out to my boy uh, Kenny Ortega for making this a happy ending and not a sad ending. You know, I wasn't trying to be emotional up at 12.51 in the morning. This was an insane episode. Oh my gosh. This was a roller coaster of emotions. I was sad. I was hyped. Yeah, I was angry. I hope you guys enjoyed my full reaction to the episodes. I reacted to Julian Phantoms for the first time in January and I just had to check out the show. It is absolutely amazing. 1010 if I suggest anybody watch the show. If you guys, you know, like this type of, you know, genre and if you guys love high school musical, um but the songs are just beautiful. They are amazing actors. Um you know, if an actor can make you hate them so much like they played the role so good that's when you know they're good like caleb and carrie they are amazing actors and their vocals are insane as well flynn the son all of them the dad they were just such good characters very underrated and they played the role amazing and i cannot wait for season two if you guys want to check out the whole season that playlist will be down below i reacted to every episode but i hope you guys enjoy me reacting to the series if you guys are new appreciate sure drop a like sub comment and turn on post links let me know if there's any shows you guys want me to check out next but behind the band and all that type of stuff is coming soon so be ready but enjoy the rest of your day and i'll see you guys next time peace take care love you